Guys, I want y'all to know that this is the most stressful week I've ever had. I spent all day on Sunday um, really planning for his team. All day. I finished streaming Mario Maker and I said I'm going to spend a couple hours building for his team and I'll get some recording done, playing a week out. I want y'all to know I did not get a team ready until about 10 30, 11 p.m. at the end of the night. I spent an entire day, a full work shift, building for Patterson's team. His team is scary. I, this is just me being completely upfront. I understand that we have the weakest team statistically in this game, but that aside, the type coverage and the core and the balance that he has, it stops everything I would want to do. You guys know how I've been, well actually I can't reveal my, reveal my secrets in case my opponents are watching, they'll get some ideas, but you guys know my secrets from my battles, and every sort of secret that I normally have, it just, I don't have a plan, okay? I don't have a plan going into this battle. So. I need all of the positive vibes just channeling into this battle, alright? I need y'all, the like button needs to be exceeding 1,000. I know it's been a while since we had a video exceed that, but it needs to come through today. I need to see that positivity. I need, like, all the tips and tricks in the comment section, alright? I need y'all to tweet at me while you're watching this battle, telling me your live reaction. Be like, yo, PK, at 12.44, when Patters did this move, that was wild. You should have done... I need all the live reactions while you're watching it. I need just positive energy being channeled towards me, because this battle feels impossible. Even right now, with the team I have built, it feels impossible. So, we're going to hit start. We're going to see how this battle goes, and hopefully, we don't get hit with the 6 0 sweep. I, I just don't know what to do. Uh, he brought. He did not bring the Mega Deonce! He brought everything I was not expecting! What? He didn't bring. I could have brought. Um, uh, what? Why? 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 He didn't bring any of his. Um, any. He brought the Inferno name. I was expecting that. Which means that his Inferno has to be a lead Inferno. He did bring the Cresselia, but he didn't bring the Quagsire. Why would he not bring the, the Quagsire? Elect, Electivire. There you go. And Cresselia. But yeah, he didn't bring... Okay, so what's my Gambit? I did find out that the... Uh, he didn't bring the Hypnotop either, either, so he doesn't have Intimidate. This is actually a lot more doable than I was anticipating it to be. He didn't bring everything I was terrified of. Um, let's see now, let's see now, let's see now, who do we want to go out into first, who is our lead, who's our best gambit, who can I put the most pressure with, I don't have anybody I can put the most pressure on with, but you know what, because he did not, I mean the Cresselia could have Moonblast, but otherwise because he has a whole team of physical attackers, I feel like Soldier Boy is my best lead. I feel like Soldier Boy is my best lead. Soldier Boy is coming through. Soldier Boy up in this hole, going to knock off all these holes. Okay, um, I, I'm I'm terrified. I don't know. I, I, I hate his team. Ah, oh, good news. If we can get one Dragon Dance up on Feraligatr, we outspeed his entire team. Unless the Infernape is scarfed. The Infernape just might be scarfed. Stall Steam. Soldier Boy up in this hole. Look at that shine. And now the time it begins. Intimidate. All right, don't be. Uh, I'm just gonna go straight. I, I could like. Okay, we're actually doing a defensive set right here. So we have nothing in special defense. We have bulk up, super uh, knock off, super fang, and all that. Now I want to predict him to swap out. No, because he could try to set. No, why would he want to set up um, a substitute on the first turn? There's no reason why he would want to set up substitute on the first turn. Because Subcomma and Cresselia will bother me. And Super Fang will not destroy a sub. <sighs> Do I just go for this? I feel like it's too early to predict, and I have the type advantage in my favor. Unless he goes for Moonblast. And Moonblast won't even one shot me. It'll take me down to really low, but it won't one shot me. So we're going to go for Knockoff, and we're going to see what his gambit is. He puts out Reflect. So that kind of lets me know that he is life, uh, Light Clay. With light clay, I'm assuming. He well, he was light clay. <clears throat> KO'd. All right. And that did nothing. Look at how little that did. Let's drop the super fang now. 
Like, why did I do so little? But actually, no, I think that actually tells me that he is a max HP, max defense. Uh, not now, it's crafty. We eight versus Cresselia, UU defensive. Without leftovers, knockoff does. Wow, they even did le Oh no, I don't have this. Oh crap, I think I just realized, I think I made a mistake. Holy crap. Wait a minute. No, 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 I did it right. I did it right. I did, I did it right. Okay, okay, okay. <clears throat> I thought I made a mistake. But no, it says 29. That did less than 29. How could that have done less than 29 if these stats are maxed out? Did I choose the wrong nature? He's supposed to be impish nature, right? I'll take that. A nerve. I'm too nervous to eat berries. Eh. That's actually good damage. That, let's see if arrow if I can um let's see, you you home claws, he's not gonna have anything in defense. Let's see what Drain Punch would do. Drain Punch would do 36, so it's not gonna be able to um even uh, KO him. Not, no, no even not even a chance to KO him right here. I already got the intimidate drop. And I don't actually no, I do have a safe switcher. Actually no, maybe I don't. Let me see. I know Aerodactyl gets Fire Fang. I know he gets Fire Fang. Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl! Aerodactyl! <laughs> I'm weird, ignore me. But yeah, let's see. I know he gets Fire Fang. He gets Bite as well, but it says that's weaker than Fire Fang. Um, Earthquake won't touch. Crunch. Crunch could hit hard. Let me see. Bronzong. Bronzong, week 8. What would a Crunch from you do? It would do... 32 to 38%. So I could take that rather well, unless he's Bandit. And I don't really know his item. I know he's not Life Orb. Let's see. To Scraft the... Aerodactyl, make him plus one. Oh, why? He was, um... He had the... Tim no, 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 okay, okay. Um... So aerial ace from you would do 35. I think it's I think it's worth um staying in and just going for drain punch. We even knock off. Let's go for drain punch. Stealth lock. Oh right, stealth lock. Right, I don't have a defogger. Right, I did not think of that. A defensive aerodactyl? What? <laughs> Holy crap! Oh, they fun! 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 So it was probably Focus Sash. Defensive Aerodactyl. What? That's a defensive Aerodactyl because Drain Punch should have did 36 to 43. and did like 15 or 20. Ha <laughs> I see you, big dog! I see you! Oh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? I could just bulk up. No, no, no. There's a chance that this thing could have Toxic. Let's go out on the Liberty Bell. I feel like Liberty Bell is my smarter play. My smartest play right now. Oh, man. Like, he's a defensive Aerodactyl. I have Intimidate on my Scrafty, and I don't want him getting Toxic because he does have bulk up. He's meant to take hits, so if he's on a timer like that, I can't have that. But this man went for bolt on um, was it? He has a defensive aerodactyl! I don't know what to expect about the rest of his team. Like, could he is he still max speed? Does he even need to be max speed? But you know what? Now that, now that I see that, I'm pretty his infernate has to be his fast attacker. Has to be choice scarfed. So can I outspeed a choice scarfed infernate with after a dragon dance? I don't know. Um uh, infernate choice scarf. Let's say you're adamant and put your level at 50. You are 160 with a choice. No, I'm not gonna speed you. I should be able to take that. He actually predict the switch into um. Wait, why did I do that much damage? He's life orb. This is such a strange little mod. So why did Drain Punch do so little? He had to predict that uh, the switch into um. That had to be a hard, uh, hard prediction. <sighs> what 
What does he have on his team? I want to get my rocks up. I want to get my rocks up. I'm going to need them in this battle. And I want to get my rocks up. But yeah, he went for crunch. Like, he pre he saw that that was a hard prediction on him. Like, because it's like, why wouldn't I have done it the first time, you know? But jeez. I see, I see your patterns with the predictions. Aw, oh, man, he'll be living um, by one. I'm mad. <sighs> hey, can Crunch, like, miss? That'd be sweet. Miss, crunch, miss. Just, just miss. You, you, you can do it. You have, like, 95 accuracy, right? Right? Yeah, yeah. Right. You can miss. You can miss. Go, go on and miss for me. By the way, I know that... You know what? I feel, I feel like a lot of people don't get by me. I make a lot of sarcastic jokes and I say I forcefully say the opposite of what is actually happening just because like I think it's funny but people think I'm serious like when I said last week that I could live a uh, like okay I was being serious about you know I could live an assault I could live a thunderbolt from assault vest but I know that you can't use dragon dance with uh, assault vest you can't use any move that's not an attack when you're holding assault vest I know that so I was being funny but people thought that I was just stupid and I don't know, I guess my humor just doesn't come across well. What kind of hacks? What is this? What's a hacks risk? Oh! Who do I go out into? Who do I go out into? Like, I want to go out into a Matarasu, but then I'm just taking stealth lock damage. And then if I go out into a Matarasu, he's free to go out into... Nobody, really. I have Iron Head on a Matarasu, and he didn't even bring it, so that move is completely useless against his team. Do I go out into Soldier Boy? Soldier Boy, he would take a hit, but I wouldn't get anything back, and I don't. I do have leftovers though. Didn't I count that Scrafty versus um? No, Scrafty versus. I don't know. I don't understand what kind of Aerodactyl this is though. I know he has Life Orb. I would to get the Intimidate drop. Aerial Ace. Would do 32 to 38%, and then I would get HP back. <sighs> I feel like my best play is probably. <sighs> I'm gonna go to Soldier Boy. Just a lower his attack. Like, I know Aerial Ace is an option for him, but I'm, I'm just gonna take that. I'm just gonna have to take it. There's no reason why I wouldn't want to go for bulk up right here. Bulk up actually seems pretty safe. Let's bulk up. He's gonna die no matter what. He has he does have aerial ace. Alright. Anticipating that. The arrow adapter is gone. First mine. Actually no, I'm sorry, first mine goes in his favor. We lost um like he got that epic crunch switching. I could have just stayed in and did anything. I probably should have just stayed in. I just, I just wasn't expecting that play. Judging by damage, I think that Soldier Boy. Um, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I'm, just, I'm so scared about his team. But with him having all physical attackers besides Amoongus, going out into Soldier right now is a really good bet for me. Um, I can take any hit. I can drain punch everybody besides the Amoongus. And um, I knock off the Caselli. I can bulk up on the Caselli as well or hit it with a Super Fang. And then start chipping it down a little bit more. Wait a minute. It wasn't Reflect up. Reflect was up. Reflect was up. That's why it didn't do that much. It wasn't a defensive Aerodactyl. It, oh, yeah. Wait. What, what am I talking about? That's going to kill me. Oh, my. That's going to kill me. Uh, uh, yeah, 
Okay, I made a bad mistake. I made a, I made a bad play. I made a bad play. I should have run out of Nomadarazu. I, I don't know why I forgot that Infernate gets close combat. I don't know why I forgot that. Alright. Let's, just, let's see these choice scarves. This is going to do. Hmm, plus one defense. I can live one. But let's say that he's banned I still live. Let's go for the drain punch. What? Wait! What? My- What? It said that it was supposed to do- What? Why did- Why did he live? Why? What just happened? Something went wrong. I just counted! I just counted, man! I don't know what just happened. We know he's not life for it, though. I, I just, I don't know what just happened. I don't know what just happened. What? I just lost Soulja Boy for no reason. My mom's just going down like, oh my god, I hate his team. What just happened? Like, I just calculated it, and it said that, uh, what is it, against an adamant choice bandit, uh, Infernape, using close combat, with plus one defense, it should have done 49 to 59%. And I was, maybe that was max roll? Oh no! Showdown automatically calculated the Intimidate drop. But he didn't have the Intimidate drop. <sighs> That's what happened. Damn it. So, removing that, removing that, that did 74 to 88. That was a bad play. Calculation was wrong. All because it, 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 it automatically asked the intimidation, and I don't like that because it assumes. Uh, what do I do? 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 Screw it. I I I just don't know. Let's assume he's going to swap out here. Who would he want to swap out into? I'm mad. Like, I thought I could live that, and I just gave up my answer to the Cresselia. Oh! I, that's not what I wanted. I got to weaken this team down a little bit more so that way I can bring in Gator. And I need to get that Moongas out here stat. I feel like his best. Yeah, he's gonna go out in Cresselia, but then. No, but what do you want? No, I feel like Cresselia, no matter what, is his best play. But I don't have anything for Cresselia. Do I play with what's right in front of me, or do I try to make a hard read? Is there any reason why I shouldn't just go for extreme speed? Not really. Let's go for extreme speed. He does withdraw. I lost my answer to this thing. I only saw Reflex. And I know he had Light Clay, so he prob probably has, um. Probably has. Um. Let's go for the flinch or I'll try to go for the burn. I'll just go for the flinch. I think I have enough speed investments in my Arcanine to where I'll speed a speed crept Cresselia. I think I did it like that. Yeah, okay. This is a reflect. Alright. Don't show off that um that moonlight. Or or can I get a quick flamethrower or a burn? I know flamethrower only has a 10%, but you know what? I'll take anything I can get right now. I was actually contemplating going for Iron Head and trying to stall him out, but nah. I don't know he was physically defensive, it'd just be an uphill battle. And I'd be playing all, I'd, I'd be rolling. And I, don't, I don't gamble. <laughs>
I'm not a gambling man. <sighs> Crit burn. That sucks, cause the light screen would have taken him out, would have definitely been um, a two shot. Alright, now I definitely need a crit. If I can get this crit and take out this um this Cresselia, it would be love. It would be love. Love, 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 love. Hi Misty. Yeah. La la Makes the world go round. Alright, let me write down light screen. If he swaps out here to preserve the Cresselia. No, I'm sure he has Moonlight on it, but wouldn't he? Moonlight in one attack? Or oh, he might even have Healing Wish, but he doesn't have anybody who want a Healing Wish right now. Or not, no, no, it's Lunar Dance for Cresselia, but still. Same thing. I like how they gave Lunar Dance, like, PP, and, like, when you use it, you die. So it has no, the PP has no use in battle. <laughs> Okay, guys, so I am going to be contacting Patters and trying to get his side of the beginning because I just realized I never swapped the uh, screen to this one. So, yeah, you guys just saw all of the, uh, was it? You guys just saw my face the entire time. That's my fault. That's my, my apologies. That is my apologies. Um, but hopefully I can just get the, the footage from him and it'll be fine. I can just put my commentary over it, but yeah, that's my bad. He does have Black Sludge. Um, so let's see, that still did a lot. He's gonna try and spore me. Oh wait, yeah, if he ever goes out into, uh, Amoongus, just go out into Vazelia. Oh my god, what if he just double played me? What if this dude just double played me? I like how I got almost all my HP back thanks to leftovers. Sounds like leftovers. Arcanine is such a good Pokemon. Defense is on point. HP is decent. Attack is decent. Special attack is decent. Like it's just an all-around good mind. I think I think that even though he's kind of one note, because he can still be defensive or, or, or offensive, um, I think that he's a really good mind in draft format. I really do. Fondango. Da -na -na. I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna write down that he has slurp bomb. I think it's gonna be annoying to take down, but you know what? I'm not gonna let him know that I have extra sensory right now, my was Elia. I'm just gonna put, drop spikes and see what he chooses to do. I did a lot of damage. And eh, no, he it's with stuff like damage like I did about 30%, so I can take a little bit more. So I'm gonna drop these spikes and see what he wants to plan out. Again, hazards are going to be my friend in this battle. And I'm glad I got the opportunity to set him up. I got rocks up as well, so I'm not mad at it. Misty just sitting here combing herself. Like, cats, like, lick their paw and then, like, just brush it over the hair. It's kind of cool. But at the same time, you think about it, they're just combing themselves with their own spit. <laughs> anyway, let's see what he chooses to do. The Electivire is still out there as a threat. The Infernape is still here as a threat. The Haxor is still here as a threat. But, um, the, Hax the Aerodactyl was clearly just sacrificial. Clearly just sacrificial. I'm just mad like that reflect. I'm mad that I forgot the reflect. I gotta write stuff like that down. Like right now, reflect is on um two. Let's see. That was one turn. And I was flame throwing. So I think reflect is on two turns. Light light screen is on one. But I do know that this still up. Pathers, please make ah. There we go. He swaps out into who? Dragon. Oh. Hmm. And this thing is poison jab, so that's an issue. Why, why would you send out this giant dragon against my cute little Wazilla? Oh, Reflect is down already? Oh, it's been longer than that. Well, I'm going out on a, a Madaratsu. Right, he's the only one with Intimidate drop. He's the only one with Intimidate drop. A Madaratsu. 
Archives. Look at him. Look how big he is. He makes hackers look tiny. Half. Ah, I love Archives so much. Ah, oh, Madarasa is doing a thing. He goes to go for Dragon Dance. All right. Dragon Dance. Dra dragon Dance. Dragon Dragon Dance. Dragon Dance. Dragon Dragon Dance. Gonna hit you with this extreme speed. So watch out, man. Gonna hit you with extreme speed right now. And you cannot speed me because you don't have a priority. Oh, that is so little. Oh, no, that's going to be Ah. <sighs> But I can't do I can see him trying to healing wish into this thing, but you know what? I'm glad I'm weakening it The Amoonga is I don't think he's too weak his regenerator. It's a thing so That's gonna be annoying to deal with Hey, I got a crit but I'm out of my series now All right, so now the question becomes Hey Haxorus, I know you're there, you got Dragon Dance up in your face, but can Toge but can P Wing take your hit? Just maybe we gon' see right now. Put in poison jab. Let's see what it does. We're gonna hit you with this move with poison jab. Oh there you go, Nam's gonna do 46, I mean 56, it do 56, it do 56, it do 56, it's right there, doing 56, it do 56, doing 56, alright, well, I guess if that's the case, let me just check my moves just in case, just to be sure, oh yeah, we have hidden power steel on this thing, again, for the freaking, um, Oh, uh, Pee-Wing's my only, my only bet, so it's not time for getting just yet. Pee-Wing, come through! And Air Slash. Cool. Man, shoutouts to the, uh... Yeah, shoutouts to the Intimidate, otherwise I would not have lived that. So Arcanine, he, he did what he had to do. He did what he had to do for us. It looks like that thing had Lumberry as well. Actually, Nexus was the one who reminded me about Lumberry. Because he said that, hey, you know, they love to sit up and there's Lumberry. I mean, didn't freaking, what's your name have that? Ha um, Iris have that in Black 2, White 2? I think she did to Haxorus. Either that or it was the um, Dragon Gem. And just had like a Dragon Gem boosted outrage. First turn, where'd she go? Oh, she went in the window. Okay. <sighs> I know you're there, Misty. I hear you. I hear you, pretty kitty. Beautiful. This thing is an issue. I know you're there, Misty. I know you're there, Misty. <laughs> I know you're there, Misty. He goes with Wild Charge. She's not life work. So now the question is, do I go out into let's see, electrifier? It's probably expert belt. Like, there's no reason why it shouldn't be expert belt. So let's see, let's put that up against Rosalia. Uh, with 104 HP and stealth locks. He might have Ice Punch though. Ice Punch will bother me. Alright, for Alligator, can you take a hit or is this just, is this it? Can I not win? It's not looking good, guys. It's not looking good.
is not looking good. He could be choice scarfed. I should have went out to Rosalia and seen if he was choice scarfed. Let's see, who have I taken out so far? The front up is still in the back. <sighs> Too many offensive threats. I just gotta see if I can live one. I should have seen if it was choice scarfed. That was my mistake. That's it, guys. He got a crit. <laughs> Come on, dude. It was my last hope. It was my last hope. You couldn't have let me have that. Ah, uh, well. I'm sure he'll reveal right now if he's um wild charged. Uh, if he's scarfed or not. I'm sure he'll reveal right now if he's scarfed or not. This is just a very... I, I just... I didn't enjoy this battle. It just seemed like... Like, don't get me wrong. I was trying. But it was tough. He was... He was choice. He was choice. That was my that, that was my stupidity. He was choice. He was choiced. I could have I could have brought that back. I could have brought that back. <sighs> damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. He was choiced. He was choice. He was choice. I thought expert. I thought expert bell, and I went on expert bell. I didn't even assume, and that means that that crit mattered because I could have lived that. <sighs> but he was choice scarfed, so it doesn't matter. He was choice scarfed, so it didn't matter. I could have, I could have brought that back. I could have brought that back. I'm, I'm disappointed in myself. I'm disappointed because I just, I made a bad play at the end. That was, I got too, I got too fixated on, on expert belt. Really got fixated on expert belt. <sighs> I'm just glad that that battle was over. That was very stressful. Um, I don't know if it, if it even like emanated through the video, but it's over, and I apologize for everybody. I apologize to everybody if I you know disappointed you in some way. But I mean, playing it and having to build against it, it was just a very scary build. Like I told you that I spent eight hours and I still didn't feel confident going to this battle with what I did. And then the Mega Deontay, he didn't even bring it. Like he just went like full force aggressive aggression because his um, Amoongus and his Cresselia was really all he needed, and the re reflect I, it messed me up as well. And then I still don't understand what happened. Actually, no, no, I don't. I still don't understand. I could have lived with Scrafty there. That really threw me off. I still don't understand what happened there going in that battle. But in any case, uh, that is how it's going to go down. So if you guys enjoyed the battle, hit the like button for me. Hopefully, we'll have a better team matchup next week, but this one, it just felt very, very tough. <laughs> I'll just say that it was, it was like a 70-30 his favor, you know, so. But in any case, that's going to end off the video. Don't forget to like the video, comment on the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, but most importantly, stay hot, guys. I'll see y'all next time.